And Tucson Unified revealing tonight to the board it has the largest one-year decline in overall enrollment it's ever seen. And Nine on your side's Liz Delia Caballero breaks down what the Enrollment Recovery Task Force is doing to try to turn that around. The largest losses can be seen in kindergarten, third grade and fifth grade. Here's how they plan on getting those students back. And you'll see that with uh, 2,784 less students on the 40th day, that was a decline of 6.3% and district enrollment. Blaine Young says the pandemic has been a major contributing factor in this sharp decline. He's TUSD's chief technology officer. Families did struggle with uh, technology related challenges. We know that that was a contributor to, to what families experienced and, and in some cases choices they made. Remote and online learning also making it difficult for students to stick around. The only grade level where we actually saw an increase was at the 10th grade. You'll see there's a 2.2% uh, increase for for, uh, this school year. Here's what Leslie Lenhart, TUSD's communications and media relations director, says the Enrollment Recovery Task Force is doing to increase enrollment. We're very proactive uh, at the beginning of the school year in connecting with families whose students were enrolled but had not shown up to class in the first 10, 10 days. They've also called parents and sent them emails with tips for remote learning. Our schools proactively reached out to our at-risk um, families. Len Hart says there's still more to be done, including providing welcome and virtual tour videos for parents and students to increase enrollment. Lustelia Caballero, Kagan 9, on your side.